Welcome to the exciting, action-packed world of crypto shooter games, where virtual battles meet real-world opportunities. Let's dive into our hand-picked list of five up-and-coming shooter games, set to take the gaming industry by storm in 2023. What's up gamers, my name's Mike and I'm your host here at Fungible Games. Today we've got an exciting one lined up for you, so make sure you like, subscribe and turn on the notification bell. So for part one of our shooter game series, we shared five first person shooters, play to earn games that are playable right now. And if you wanna see that one, when you finish watching this video, you'll be able to find it in the link below. While the first generation of crypto shooter games continue to evolve, today we're gonna to focus on five upcoming Web3 games that are in the development and alpha access stages. Get ready to immerse yourself in intense firefights, vast landscape and endless strategies. And first up on this list, we have Shrapnel. Shrapnel is a AAA first person shooter game built by Shrapnel Games on Avalanche. This customizable shooter game built on Unreal Engine 5 is under development and showcased its first public demo in June 2023. It is striving to create true digital ownership, play to own. Shrapnel offers a unique and unconventional cutting edge gaming experience with a focus on having things that are only yours and make everything feel just the way you like it. The core component of this game revolves around an event they call the Extraction. This event is characterized by its high intensity nature and multi-stage structure. It is designed to encourage players to embrace risk-taking as they navigate through the various stages. Successful navigation of this challenging event reaps substantial rewards, which adds an extra layer of achievement for players who demonstrate skill and proficiency. Now, the Shrapnel team has really impressive experience on this one. They have experience of notable Emmys and BAFTA award-winning franchise including Halo, Call of Duty, Madden NFL, Star Wars, Bioshock, Skylanders, Westworld, and more. Just from looking at this trailer, the game graphics and environments are looking absolutely stunning. And the game looks very promising. Now for us players, Shrapnel is packed with a lot of things. It's got a rich set of player creation tools that combine combat, design, curation, and connection with a community of players that own the platform and decide its future. So as the years go by, that's gonna be something that becomes more and more popular in crypto. We have DAOs, we have token holders, we have NFT holders. The goal is to get the responsibility. Once the game is built, instead of it just being revolving around one team that makes all the decisions, instead, let's get this DAO, the Decentralized Autonomous Organization, of all the players playing the game from around the world. Let's have a community and let's have votes. What improvements do we wanna see? Are things unbalanced? Do we want something nerf? Or maybe instead of just thinking of basic things like nerfing something if something's OP, well, maybe you want to create a whole new side world or side quest. If enough people get involved in this and we've got the backing, these types of things we can communicate with devs and over the years to come, we can create a fully immersive gaming experience built by the players. Shrapnel is currently in week two of its Insignia beta challenge with a $5,000 prize pool around the corner. An event for creators to build exciting creations and unique designs with easy tools including PFPs, emblems, and symbols. Players can truly own and show off their creations. These insignias can be integrated into the Shrapnel game to personalize characters, weapons, and gear. And even more exciting updates are on the way as well, like a mobile version and the option for you to sell your design. So to participate in this, make sure you go to shrapnel.com and register an account. From there, go to create.shrapnel and design your best insignia and make sure to share your designs using hashtag insignia challenge. And from this, they're gonna pick the best designs to win and there's gonna be new prizes every week. Now, there's obviously a lot to be excited about Shrapnel, but it is still in its early phases and we would love to hear what you think about it. So if you could go to fungible.games slash games slash Shrapnel, we would love it if you could leave a review in that area and we'll be sure to check it out. And the next game on the docket is the free to play Metal Core. Metal Core is a first-person, third-person, multiplayer, mechanized combat game built on Immutable. Team up with your group to fight for territory on an alien planet with lots of valuable minerals. You can make vehicles, create gear, get new pilots, build on land, and trade your stuff. 
For the dynamics on this one, Metalcore players are thrust into a battle for territorial supremacy among three unique factions. The rebellious metal punks, the devote holy corporation, and the oppressive gearbreakers. And of course, each faction delivers a unique gameplay experience. And for gameplay, players can design and build their own combat vehicles using a variety of blueprints. These blueprints, along with the vehicles they create, are player owned and can be traded and sold by the players, adding an extra layer of depth and personalization to the game. Metalcore is currently in its alpha stage, but it just got a lot of eyeballs because Immutable showcased it at Gamescom. So good news for you, pre-registration for open beta is currently on. Once you register, you will be on track to receive your bonus vehicle of either the versatile Risco Tank, formidable Wardog Mech, or nimble Damselfly Aircraft. You can claim your prize when open beta actually arrives before the end of 2023. And when you do play the game, make sure you go to Fungible Games and leave your dedicated, honest review. Let us know what you think of this game. And the next game we have coming up is something you've definitely heard from us before, and that is Citizen Conflict. Citizen Conflict is a free-to-play hero shooter game designed to merge the best of both worlds. It is a game that mixes exciting hero battles with both competitive esports style and big open world map where lots of players can play together. This game has a really cool story where different groups of heroes are always fighting for control. The game is set in the virtual Ether Islands Battlegrounds. Players engage in virtual battles and strategic gameplay. The game offers various rewards and exclusive items to enhance gameplay. As players engage in battles and complete objectives, they earn rewards and progress through the game. This progression might include unlocking new heroes, abilities, skins, and other customization options. The game, which runs on the BNB chain, is currently in Alpha Stage 3. The game introduces the Alpha 3.0 Box, a toolkit with valuable rewards. Alpha 3.0 Box enhances the gaming experience and offers unique items. If you haven't yet, make sure you download it now, play it, acquire points, and work towards that $3,000 prize pool. And if you're a community member and have been around the altcoin buzz scene for a while, you may have even participated with Maddie before. Let us know if you participated in that. And of course, if you want to have another one of these community events where we get Maddie and some other people from altcoin buzz involved as well, let us know in the comments below. And remember guys, here at Fungible, we want to make this community experience better for you. So we often post new articles and reviews on Fungible Games. So just a week ago, we see Jeffrey Francis gave a review on Citizen Conflict Alpha 3.0, which is currently live now. And it's nice to see a game like this get a lot of popularity because Call of Duty, Overwatch, those type of games bring so much action and eyeballs to the gaming community itself. So this is a potential game where we could see that carryover of traditional coming crypto. So let's see what Jeffrey dove into this. So the first thing we see here, new maps, heroes, and the $3,000 prize pool. He talks about the immersive world of the first person shooter, kind of what we were talking before, and then what you need to know about. So we go through the highlights of the Citizen Conflict Alpha 3.0. So before you even get into the game yourself, you can come here, skim through, and know what you're gonna get yourself into. And then of course, like I was saying earlier, we have done things with Altcoin Buzz. And then of course, the challenges that the Citizen Conflict team, but everything you need to know from little teasers to breaking down what to expect. In this case, like we said earlier, we're launching the Alpha 3.0 box. So we've got that kind of information for you. And for here, if you wanna see how to mint the box, you can follow the steps accordingly. So after you've checked out Alpha 3.0, make sure you come over to the Citizen Conflict Review page on our website, and you can see the game has a 4.0. We've got 19 ratings. Maddie, our host here, we can see what he has to say about it and you can read through what everyone else is saying. We're seeing the graphics and the gameplay given a five all around. Some people have some things to say about the economy. Like Luke here, Citizen Conflict has always been attractive to me. I will play the Alpha 2.0. Luke, I hope you're here now playing Alpha 3.0. So we'd love it if you could come and leave a review for yourself. Next up is Flight Force 4, a sci-fi first person shooter. The game features a space war between humans and Zions taking place across multiple planets 
in the year 2087. Published by New Zealand-based Tech3 Studio, Flight Force 4 is built on the Solana blockchain and in Unreal Engine 5. And the game can currently be played now on demo mode on Hyperplay. In Flight Force 4, players are immersed in a dynamic and visually stunning virtual world set in an interplanetary war between humanity, known as Defenders, and the alien Zions. The gameplay centers around fast-paced action, strategic decision-making, and teamwork, making it a thrilling experience for all first-person shooter enthusiasts. Now, economy is where some of these first-person shooters in the crypto gaming world can mess these things up a little bit. But for these guys, we've got some optimism. Let's check out what they're doing. This first person shooter is free to play, but buying NFTs will give you some more options. Features such as advanced game modes and additional maps. And players can even earn NFTs in game and sell them in marketplace. Or not quite ready to sell that item, but you wanna make a little bit of income from it, well now this game introduces renting the NFT as well. And great to get everyone started in this game, you currently don't have to attach a crypto wallet, you can just start playing right away. The game rewards skill and accomplishment, offering players the chance to earn valuable rewards through successful gameplay. These rewards can include rare items, powerful weapons, and distinctive character skins. And for the latest update from them, we have an airdrop alert. Airdrops are available for OG and Helios Defender character holders. Every week, rewards will be given to the owner of the wallet with the cheapest items available for sale. So it's great to see gaming bringing in some more farming for airdrops. We all know about it for your favorite altcoins or if you wanna mess around on a new blockchain and farm in their liquidity pools or on their DEXs to try and get some rewards and hopefully their tokens will be valuable one day. But this is kind of really cool because if you like the game already and you just hold some of the inventory NFTs in your wallet, it's like you're farming the airdrop for future game surprises. So you might get some more skins or new weapons before everyone else and all you have to do is farm an airdrop simply by holding these items. So it's a nice, simple, and unique way this game is integrating airdrops. So even though it's really early days, these airdrops can be worth $10 or more of real money, or like we were saying earlier, some unique in-game items. And we definitely really appreciate it. If you check out this game, make sure you go to Fungible Games and leave it a review. And for game number five, we have an exciting one because they have been in development for a while, Ever since we saw the Solana NFT boom in 2021, we've got cute cats in mechs and there's gonna be a really awesome AAA battle game coming with Neon Heroes. This game lets you play as a Neon Cat piloting a Guardian mech set in a decadent world of Nokovia full of technology and evil corporations. The game is developed by Nine Lives Interactive and developed on the Solana blockchain. Neon Heroes offers diverse character types such as the bulky bulwark tanks, agile Deathmark Assassins, and the supportive Megami units. This game aims to strike a balance between engaging crypto features and enjoyable gameplay, allowing players to help real cats through in-game actions that trigger donations to animal charities. As you know, over the years we've seen so many crypto projects talk about charity, but this one, it's kind of cute because we've got our cute little cats in these mech suits and they're actually gonna be supporting animal charities. And what's great about this, with a cat-loving CEO, we have Rude Robots now focusing on the overall amazing gaming experience instead of just the technology itself. And for the latest update of Neon Heroes, we have their pre-alpha registration. They are introducing Playtest Playground, and in a span of two weeks, they are unveiling their upcoming thrilling launch for Neon Heroes, the playtest of the Team Deathmatch Arena. You can get the opportunity to experience sections of gameplay through mini games within the playtest playground. By participating, players also get priority to future playlist releases, including the upcoming pre-alpha. So with a game like this that has fun-loving cat characters, a passionate team behind it, and they were already part of the Solana NFT boom in 2021, you know that this is a game that you're gonna wanna pay attention to for those early releases. So I think this is a pre-alpha that you should definitely register for. So to participate, make sure you register in advance. You go to their website and go to the playtest section. And of course, as always, after you give this game a shot, once it becomes available, make sure you come over to fungible.games and leave us your honest review. We would love to see what you, the community, have to say. Well, that wraps up our list of the top upcoming shooter games in 2023. Embrace the power of blockchain and experience the thrill of action-packed shooter games 
that allow you to truly own your digital asset. And that brings us to the end of this video. If you enjoyed it, let us know by leaving us a comment. Let us know what other games you'd like to see featured. We'd really appreciate it if you could subscribe and hit that notification bell. And of course, leave us a like or a dislike if you didn't. And of course, until next time, we'll see you on the battlefield.